What's going on everyone? My name is Bass and welcome back to How Not to Play Battle Spot. This is your which we go into Battle Spot, play for games, and if we win, that's fantastic. I'm not gonna show you guys and also Battle Spot. In today's episode, we have the second episode with the all grown up theme, the theme with baby Pokemon all evolved into their final form and ready to go, ready to battle. So let's go ahead and hit that challenge button. I'm not wasting it any time right here. And if you do want to leave a suggestion for a future theme you'd like to see used on the series, then go ahead and do that in the comments section below. And this is episode 90, so that means we're gonna have two battles. It's it's an incredible it's a milestone and of course another Japanese fighter another Japanese player trainer whatever you want to call him Oh my god the power and not so much the power Torkoal actually you know what I'm not gonna sleep on the Torkoal the Torkoal is actually a threat I remember um I remember when I did the bug monotype I got swept of a Torkoal so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna underestimate the Torkoal I do see the Hydreigon, and the Aegislash and the Tyranitar is big big candidate to the Pokemon that are gonna come so I had to prepare for that I have to prepare accordingly for that, uh, so let's do that right now. I feel like the Azumarill, once again, is going to be a nice little starter. Um, for the Tyranitar or for the Hydragon. Uh, dragon. of course, the My- Oh, no, the Meowstic, the Meowstic, that's how you say his name. That's how you say his name. That could also start off as well, which would be a little bit of a threat. Um, actually, a lot of a threat. A big threat, indeed. A big threat that I don't want to have to uh, deal with, so... Mm, I don't know. What should, I, what, should, what, should we, what should we lead off with? I'm kind of thinking Snorlax. I'm kind of thinking Snorlax because... Uh, you know, we can we can take special hits really well, and then we can like curse and set up, and that would be great. Oh, the, the age of slashes is nasty though. I don't like looking at age slashes. I really don't. Uh, I'm gonna start up with the Snorlax. You know, nice little bulk there. I kind of want to take the Mega Lucario as well, just in case. Um, we're gonna do that. We're gonna take the Mega Lucario and the final Pokemon, the final Pokemon man. Who should it be? Who's it gonna be? It's not gonna be Hitmonlee because we always have we already have a Fighting type, so don't we? We don't need two. We don't need two Fighting types. Azumarill is a big can. Ah, oh, but the Rotom Mo. I don't, mm, do I have anything for the Rotomo? I guess Snorlax kind of is okay for Rotomo, but not it, not not amazing, not amazingly okay for Rotomo. Um, I don't want to take Roserade because of Torkoal. Ooh, uh, I, I might just take the Azumarill again. I might just take the Azumarill again. Uh, oh, God, you know what? I'm gonna take Togekiss. I'm gonna take Togekiss. Yeah, let's just take Togekiss. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's battle. Let's battle. Come on, it's time to duel. It's time to duel. Um, yeah, that's that's a totally different series. Yeah, I, I'm. It's not time to duel. It actually is. Maybe I don't know. Is this? Um, it's a battle, not a duel. What am I saying? All right, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Let's fight. You got a nice star on your hat there. I like that. I like that a lot. We got Snorlax, a bulky motherfucker, stand here. This bulky ass motherfucker. And as predicted, you did lead off with the Meowstic, which means you're probably gonna set up some screens. You're probably gonna set up some screens, which means I'm gonna set up- Oh, wait a minute, Sacred Sword bypasses all stats, raises, and I think lowers- lowers in this- <laughs> I think it bypasses pretty much everything, but I am still gonna go for a curse just on the off chance that you might not have it. You're gonna go for the Reflect first turn, of course, that's the only logical thing to do. I'm gonna go for the curse so we can have some nice defense and some nice special defense as well. We're gonna be so bulky! We're gonna be so bulky! And I feel like this Meowstic can't really do anything to me. You know, if it wants to paralyze me, I guess, I guess it could paralyze me, couldn't it? I think so, but I have rest, so I don't care. <laughs> I don't care about what you're saying, because I have rest. I have rest. Oh, you're gonna yawn, which means the chest barrier is gonna go off early, so I don't really care about that. Again, gonna curse, gonna curse up. You can yawn for days. You can yawn for days. What I don't want you to do, though, I don't want you to not yawn me twice. I really don't want you to yawn me twice, so I just, I'm just gonna attack now. I'm just gonna go for the crunch, and you might switch. I don't think you're gonna switch, though. I don't think you're gonna switch. Um, the chest is gonna keep me awake, so that's that's nice. That's always good. That's always good. What are you gonna go for now? You're gonna withdraw. Can you withdraw to Age Slash? That would be nice. I can. I. Oh, what? That is the Rotomo. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so no Age Slash so far. That's great. I'm gonna hit this thing up with the quick crunch. It's not gonna do much at all. Wow. I expected so much better. Snorlax, I mean, I know the reflex up, but you're plus two. All right, let's just go for a body slam. Maybe you could paralyze this thing. Never mind, it's, it's electric type. It's not gonna get paralyzed. But we can, should do a little bit more damage. We should be able to do a little bit more damage. What you can do now, huh? What you gonna do? What you gonna do when Snorlax comes for you? You're gonna go for a Volt Switch. I, mm, If you Volt Switch into Aegis Slash, I will, I will give you the game. I will give you the game. Actually, no, I won't. That's such ridiculous. I'm not gonna do that. You're probably gonna go back into the Meow Stick, which is going to yawn me and put me to sleep again, which is not. Oh, that's a Torkoal! So you have the mouse stick, the Rotom Mo, and the Torkoal. Okay. All right. That's that's actually okay. Get a paralyzed. No paralyzed. Oh, the Rocky Helmet. The Rocky Helmet. The Helmet of Rocks. All right. I'm just going to curse again then. I can curse until the Reflect Wars off. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. 
You're gonna yawn again. You got that double yawn. All right. All right. That's fine. I can I can take going to sleep. I can take go. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna rest this turn so I can guarantee two turns of sleep. Oh, it's diabolical! It's diabolical! It's insane! Why would he do it? He's gonna do it! He's crazy! He's crazy! He's gonna do it! Oh my lord! The rest is coming! The rest is coming! Don't you think the rest ain't coming? The flamethrower! Oh, I gotta take that so well. Look! Look how we eat up those hits! I'm gonna rest now, which guarantees two turns of sleep, as opposed to what Yon would guarantee, which is not gonna guarantee anything, actually. Yon is not gonna guarantee anything. Uh, there's the sleep. I'm gonna sleep you guys, don't even care. Thank you very much, thanks for coming along man, but uh, I'm gonna sleep, I'm gonna stay asleep for two turns, so I don't know what he's gonna plan to do. He can't really touch me all that much, to be completely honest. Um, I do have two, plus two defense, and plus two attack, so as soon as this reflect wears off, you're gonna be in for some, uh, you're gonna be in for some hurting. You're gonna be in for, for a little bit of, a little bit of hurting. It's, it's gonna be painful, it's gonna be painful. Trust me, the Snorlax knows, the Snorlax knows. It is known, it is known. All right, Snorlax, are you gonna, are you just gonna sleep? He's gonna stay sleeping. Look at him. He's oh, he's sleeping while standing up. Look at that. Look at that majestic being standing in front of us there. I love Snorlax. Snorlax is amazing. Probably my favorite normal type, actually. I'm gonna go for a Stone Edge there. I am plus two defense, so we should be able to take this relatively well. There you go. No damage at all. No damage at all. The Snorlax tactics is too much. It's far too much. This guy can't handle it. He's like, shit, man, I can't do it. Snorlax, oh, I can't do it, man. All right, he's gonna take that. Oh, look, look at this. Look at this. I can rest for days. I have no worries. There's the reflex gone. I'm gonna wake up next turn and go for a body slam. Something is gonna take a lot of damage here. Something is gonna take a lot of a plus two body slam from a Snorlax. You know, it's gonna it's gonna be painful. It's gonna be hurting. I wonder if this body slam no the body, body slam has a set uh, amount of damage it does. If body slam did more damage, um the amount oh there's the rocky helmet, I forgot about that. If, if, if body slam did more damage, uh the heavier the Pokemon is, that'd be so amazing. Snorlax would be so OP. It'd be ridiculous. Oh you're gonna burn me though! I don't care. I've got rest. <laughs> rest does not care. Really, it doesn't. It doesn't, it doesn't even the slightest. Uh, we could paralyze this thing because we're not going to be able to kill it, unfortunately. Um, we're not going to be able to kill it this turn. So we're going to get hit by the Rocky Helm. We're going to get hit by the burn. Nothing matters because I have rest. So you're not going to kill me this turn. Let's get a super crit on the Stone Edge or something along those lines. It doesn't really matter. Willow is big. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you doing? Are you? Have you just given up? Have you given up on the power of the Snorlax? <laughs> Look at that! Snorlax just does not care! Snorlax, does, Snorlax is slipping on the job and it's still beating you. Snorlax is slipping on the job and it's still beating you. How do you feel? You must feel pretty bad. You're still gonna stay in and just go for the flamethrowers. I don't think you understand. I don't think you understand that Snorlax doesn't care. Snorlax also has the thick fat by the way, so it's taking those fireheads really nicely, which is amazing. Amazing! It's taking those uh, fireheads so- you, I don't- what are you doing? What are you trying to accomplish here? I'm just gonna stay slipping. I'm just gonna stay slipping. What you may do is you may predict the waking up on this turn and go for a will o wisp If you do that, then I commend you, sir. You know, you're not gonna go, you're gonna go for the flames. Oh, wait, because I go second, so I don't wake up until. Oh, okay. Alright, that's I'm completely fine with this. Body slamming your whole team, and you're dead. This, uh, the torque hole is down, which leaves us one Pokemon up, which I'm happy with it. No, yeah, I'm happy with it. We are setting up with a nice little plus two attack and plus two defense. I think the Meowstic's gonna come in right now and probably set up another Reflect. Not that I care. Not that I care if you want to do that. In comes the Meowstic. I'm gonna set up another Reflect. Yawning is not gonna care. I don't care about Yawning. I don't care about Reflects. Oh! God fucking God. Wow, double status. Double status Meowstic. Really? Really now? Oh, I'm gonna smack you in the face with the crunch though. I'm gonna smack you with this plus two crunch. There's no way you can survive this. No way. Oh, you do! You do survive it! Well done! And the Reflect is gonna go up now, which is unfortunate, but there's really nothing I can do about it. Uh, there's the Reflect. Hopefully we can at least kill this thing this turn. Hopefully we can at least kill it. What is this final Pokemon? I can't I can't remember. What is this final Pokemon? I I don't know. This is what happens when you bring <laughs> Torkoals and things to the battle spot. Actually, you know what? Torkoal could be really good. I got- once again, I got swept up for Torkoal, so I can't say anything. I can't say a damn thing, because I got swept up a token, so there you go. Uh, the Rotom Mo. Oh, the Rotom Mo. There is Mo right there. There's the Rotom Mo. Do I want to rest this turn? I don't feel like it's going to do much damage to me. I'm going to rest, though. I'm going to rest to get rid of this paralysis. I don't like the paralysis. You're going to go for a Thunderbolt. We're going to see how much damage this Thunderbolt is going to do. Oh, it, do it does a decent amount, actually. It does a decent amount. I'm going to rest to get my health back. So I don't want to mess around this thing. I actually still have two Pokemon on the back burner, so it's 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 pretty much Rotom Mo against the world right here. I'm just gonna stay sleeping right now. He's probably gonna keep going with the Thunderbolts. I'm gonna try- I'm actually just gonna try and like stall out the Reflex, because that's- that's kind of annoying. 
That's kind of annoying. Oh, oh, that, oh, that was a crit. It was a crit. There you go. Congratulations. You got a crit. There, there you go. The game is trying to help you. The game is trying to help you here. But unfortunately, it's just not going to be enough. It's not going to be enough to do it. Because Snorlax is too bulky. Snorlax is far too bulky. Was that a crit? That looked like a crit. That looked like a crit. I swear that, that crit and the non-crit did the same amount of damage. I swear. I swear it by all that, that is good in the poker world. Uh, I'm gonna go for another Thunderbolt, uh, of course. I'm gonna wake up this turn. Can I take- Oh, I don't think I can take another Thunderbolt. I don't know if I can take another Thunderbolt, actually. I don't know if I can take one. Gonna hit you with that Body Slam, which is unfortunately not gonna take you- Oh, but you have the Citrus! Congratulations, sir. You have the Citrus. Is the Reflex gonna wear off? No, it is not. Uh, let me actually see what other Pokemon I have. I have Togekiss. I have Togekiss and Lucario, so nothing- It doesn't even matter if Snowlex goes down at this point, but, um, of course the Thunderbolt's gonna go off. I'm gonna get hit by it. Which is unfortunate, and oh, I thought we were going to survive for just a split second there, I thought we were going to survive, must have got maximum damage there, which is unfortunate, but what can you do about it, can't do a damn thing, of course, um, uh, I might just go into Lucario and just have fucking Flash Cannon, or I could just go into Togekiss, I don't want to go into Togekiss because we're weak to electric, I mean, we could probably still take a hit, but I don't know, I don't know how many hits we could take, here comes the Lucario just to clean up, here comes the Lucario to finish the job, Tho, uh, Tho, what am I, what am I, what am I talking like this for? Tho, I don't know why I'm saying that, Lucario Knight is reacting to the Mega Ring, and there you go, I don't know, I don't know if taking a Lucario into a Battle Spot is cheap, I kind of feel bad about doing it against this guy, because he's just using Pokemon that aren't really, I guess, um, OU or anything like that, he's not using so, super overpowered Pokemon, but he did somehow have someone on the team, so, I don't know, it's not really effective, oh, damn, oh, damn, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna take this Thunderbolt, we're, oh, we didn't take that very well, actually, <laughs> wow, Alright, so the Flash Cannon is going to take out the Rotom, and that is going to be GG for you, sir. That's going to be GG for you, so that is a victory. We did have to use Mega Lucario, but whatever, it doesn't, I feel like, I feel like the Mega Lucario didn't really matter. I could have brought anything else, and it would have been able to clean up that Rotom Mo. Like, I think even the Togekiss would have been able to clean up that Rotom Mo. Probably. Probably. I had three Pokemon, he had one, it was, it was pretty injured. It, it, it was irrelevant, it was irrelevant, anything could have done it. That wasn't the... The, the, the main force in the battle was Snorlax, and Snorlax is the goddamn man. Snorlax is the man. Alright, let's keep going. We're gonna go for another battle today because it is a milestone. It is the 90th episode. Wow, 90 episodes. I have no idea what I'm gonna do for the 100th episode. I don't even know if I'm gonna do anything special. I don't know. Maybe it'll just be a, oh, maybe it'll be like, oh, I don't know. What can I, what can I think we have for the 100th episode? I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, but uh, we're gonna be facing Mike from Greece. I have not seen someone from Greece in a while, if ever, but uh, here we go. Mike from Greece has a Vaporeon, a Klepki, a Ferrothorn, a Hirotom Heat, a Scrafty, and a Gliscor. So, really, mm, oh, super bulky team here, super annoying team with the Gliscor and the Ferrothorn and the Klepki. Gonna need some fire. I don't have any fire. <laughs> I'm gonna need some fire, but I don't have any. That's 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 not nice. That's not good at all, actually. Um, I kind of want to go with Togekiss to lead things off, because I feel like Toge if I start setting up with Togekiss, that could be GG. That could be GG. It could be, but it might not be. You know, if he starts off with the Klefki, I'll be in a really bad position. So I kind of want to start off the him only as well. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know, actually. I, mm, you know what? The, uh, the Himalaya is gonna do nothing to pretty much any of these other Pokemon apart from the Scrafty. Maybe the Vaporeon. I don't know. They're not really physically bulky. They're not really known for being physically bulky. Maybe I should go for the Rose Raid. Ah, uh, not really. There's a lot of there's all Steel types in there. A lot of things that resist it. And the Rotom Heat. So I'm not gonna go with the. Uh, not gonna go with that. I'm gonna lead off with the Himalaya. We're gonna do that. That's the thing. That's the thing we could do. Yes, it is indeed 100%. 100%. 100%. Uh, I want to take the Lucario. I want to take the Lucario. I feel like it could be really helpful. I do. I do. I, I, I really feel it. I'm feeling it. I feel it in my fingers. I feel it in my toes. Alright, let's go. I'm taking Togekiss, I'm taking him only, and I'm taking Lucario. We're gonna see how this goes. We're gonna see how it goes against Mike. What are you gonna do, Mike? Please don't lead off with the Klefki. Please don't be that guy. Please. Don't. Just don't. Don't be that guy. D don't. D Mike. Mike. Leading off with the Glide Score, which is a little bit better than I uh, had expected. Again, not really amazing though. Because you're probably going to get. Oh, you're going to go for a substitute? You know what? I, um, I don't want to fake out just yet. I don't want to use my normal gem just yet. I want to switch into Togekiss. I'm going to switch into Togekiss because I do have Roost. Uh, the Earthquake is not going to matter. I can just set up with Nasty Plots if I really want to. You know, if I, that, that's also an option. You're going to go for Togekiss. You're going to go for an Earthquake right off the bat. You do go for an Earthquake right off the bat, which is amazing. So that does let me go for a Nasty Plot. 
that does let me go from nasty plot, which will leave me with plus two. Um, I do want to set up because this this thing kind of annoying. You're gonna go for a toxic here or a substitute. Either or is going to be kind of uh, meh. It's gonna be meh for me. You're gonna go poison. Oh yeah, poison chap. What? What? When did this happen? Why did no one tell me about this? <laughs> when did this happen? When did people start using this? My Mike from Greece, you are changing up the meta. You're changing up the meta. Okay. I, oh, I, mmm, do I want to go for flinches or do I want to go for power? I'm going to go for power, I'm going to go for the Dazzling Gleam, we are plus two right now. Gliscor isn't the most specially bulky thing in the world, the stab, we got an annihilated thing with a crit! <laughs> we got a crit! Okay, thankfully we didn't get poisoned off the, uh, who's more, what's it? Because that would have sucked. I'm assuming that he didn't bring the Klefki, I really hope he didn't bring the Klefki, I really hope he didn't bring the Klefki, I don't like Klefkis. I don't. I don't like him. Here comes a Ferrothorn, which I'm completely okay with, apart from it may have like a steel time move. I don't really know what uh, Ferrothorn could run. So I'm just gonna go for the Arrow Slash. The most obvious play since obvious plays. Can we might get a flinch here though. We might get a flinch here. We flinched him! <laughs> oh, Togekiss. I didn't even want that. I did not even I guess I kind of did. I was secretly hoping for a flinch. That's gonna be the Ferrothorn dead, unfortunately for you. That is gonna be the dead Ferrothorn right there. BAM! Right in the Ferrothorn's mouth, which is good because the Ferrothorn could actually be pretty threatening. I actually the Lucario, I had a Lucario, so it wasn't gonna be amazingly threatening. But we're gonna see what his last Pokemon is here. Togekiss is just eating up the lives. He's ending lives. He's slashing people left and right. Oh wow. Togekiss, I didn't even want that flinch, but you came through. And the last Pokemon is gonna be the Scrafty. The Scrafty. And you know what Scrafties are four times a week too? A nice little Dazzling Gleam. That's what they're four times weak to. BAM with the Dazzling Gleam. Four times effective, plus two. It's not surviving that. There was no way. It got annihilated. It was a crit. I didn't need that. I didn't. I feel like the only hacks I actually needed in that battle was probably the crit against the Glide score. I feel bad about that. I'm so sorry, Mike from Greece. Mike from Greece, I'm so sorry. It seems like whenever I fight someone who's not Japanese, I just get unnecessary hacks. I, I'm so sorry. Mike from Greece. I'm sorry, but that's gonna be all it for the day. If you did enjoy this, please leave a like. That'd be absolutely amazing. If we can hit that like goal, I'm gonna try to ab I'll try my absolute best to make sure there's two videos for you guys on the daily. But that's gonna be all it for this time. 19th episode of How Not to Play Battle Spot. It's my wow, 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 wow. But um, once again, if you have any suggestions for future themes you'd like to use on the series, go ahead and leave them in the comment section below. For now, I'm gonna thank you all so much for watching. If you made this one more video, and I'm gonna see you guys next time.